one of my most expensive skincare purchases in review today. It's the SkinCeuticals CE Ferulic 15% L-Ascorbic Acid. Now this is a patented daytime vitamin C serum that's supposed to deliver advanced environmental protection and improve the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles, loss of firmness, and brighten the skin's complexion. It has clinically proven to reduce combined oxidative damage from free radicals generated by UV, ozone, and diesel exhaust by up to 41%. And lastly, they also state that once absorbed, this vitamin C serum remains effective for a minimum of 72 hours. This serum can be used by normal, dry, sensitive, and mature skin types and has also been tested and suitable for post-laser use. Always consult with your physician though for post-procedure care. It is non-comonogenic, clean, phthalate-free, fragrance-free, sulfate-free, and paraben-free. I'm going to add the ingredient list here so that you can go ahead and read and make an informed decision. I see here that it does contain 15% L-ascorbic acid, which is a superior antioxidant and has a lot of benefits. It is also a very highly potent, pure form of vitamin C which helps neutralize free radicals and protects against oxidative stress while providing visible anti-aging benefits. It also has a pure form of vitamin E to neutralize free radicals and replenishes the skin's lipid. It is proven to act synergistically with vitamin C. I also see a plant-based antioxidant called ferulic acid which neutralizes free radicals and enhances the antioxidant benefits and stability of vitamin C and E. Now, a thing to keep in mind when buying the SkinCeuticals CE Ferulic Serum, it can range from clear to pale yellow due to its active ingredients. But over time, it will turn deep yellow, orange, and even brown, which means the product is less effective and should be replaced. When I bought mine, it was a pale yellow. Now, the texture is usually light and liquidy and absorbs into the skin almost instantly. Now a little tip when using vitamin C serum, the best time to use it is in your morning skincare routine. So I would use it after my toner and hyaluronic acid and use a moisturizer and a sunscreen after that. It is essential to use sunscreen when applying vitamin C. Studies have shown that using sunscreen with vitamin C protects the skin from further photo damage caused by ultraviolet rays. You do get this in just one size glass bottle with a dropper and it is priced at a hefty amount of $166 and you can find it in most major pharmacies or also on the SkinCeuticals website. I wouldn't suggest buying this on Amazon. I've used this for about one and a half months and I have to say my skin doesn't like it. I would use about three to four drops on my face and neck. During the initial days when I started using this, I did not see any changes with my skin, but then slowly started breaking out all over my cheeks, my chin, and my forehead. So I stopped using the serum and started treating my breakouts. Once my breakouts were done, I started using the vitamin C serum again. And it was the same thing. I would not see any breakouts in the first week, but they would slowly reappear on my skin. This wasn't working for me. I could not seem to figure out why this was happening to my skin, but I, I think Probably the serum is too strong for my skin and I have used vitamin C serums in the past before But I feel like with this serum I think it's too strong for my skin. I have not given up on ferulic acid as of yet I am also trying the timeless ferulic acid as well as the may love uh, Serum so you should see a review on that soon and when I do put that up I will link it up here for you to go ahead and watch that as well That's it for today's review if you enjoyed this video and stay till the end Don't forget to hit that like button and if you want to see more I suggest you hit that subscribe button. I make videos every week. I'll see you. Bye!